Well, good morning, brothers and sisters of the hook. This is Big John and Salty Kayak. We are out here at an artificial reef outside of Ponce Inlet. We just got here. Let me take my life jacket off. See, I got my lanyard hooked to my life jacket which will shut off the motor automatically if I get tossed out by the big waves. Ain't nothing but smart. I have it nice and handy right there. Okay, let's see where we are. Uh, this is at the Black Sea Bass Hole in Daytona Beach. New Smyrna Beach. I see somebody coming out. I think that might be Mr. David. Pots and lets right over there too. We are out here, look at this. One of those rare January days. Not too big a waves, but you can't fall asleep either. <laughs> okay, folks. We'll get back to you when some action starts happening. But let me take this. I have something I need to say, been needing to say for a long time. Uh, let's see here. What are, where is it? Where is it? I got a happy birthday to somebody. I said that I would give them a shout out. It was a while ago. Okay. Happy birthday to Dante Jernigan. Dante Jernigan. Thank you. Happy birthday, Dante. Your girlfriend must think you are pretty special. Your birthday was December 31st. I'm late, but. Better late than never. Never late is better. Just remember that. All right, we'll get back to you in a little bit. Happy birthday, Dante. Okay, I've just dropped a sardine straight down and had it taken straight off. <laughs> but we just got here. There's, there's David. Big John over there. He got himself something. It is a, oh my gosh, one of those rare and endangered red snappers. I can't believe it. And I got... A vermilion! Woo! A little short, but he's a vermilion. I'll measure him up if he makes 12 inches squeezed. He's a coming home with me. <laughs> he goes down. I'm not sure how clear it is down there, and if it's clear, I'll drop the cams down later. Oh yeah, oh yeah. He's a 12er. He's a 12-er already. A vermilion. Come here, come here, come here. Let me make absolutely certain. Yep, 12 and a quarter. Thank you, Lord. Skunk's out of the boat. First drop down. Woohoo! It's gonna be a great day. I think that we both got a red snipper. And big John over there struggling. Oh, black sea bass, black sea bass. Well, I think I, this is a feeling of a snapper here. That's a shorty though, I can tell. There's a nice, what is that? Oh, that's just a little red snapper. Just a little guy. I'm gonna tell y'all a quick story. Of love and glory. Uh, 13 inches. 13, as long as it can be, right? As long as it can be, yeah. By the way, excuse me for my what looks like a dirty boat. We yeah. had a windstorm. Boat's not dirty. It's got leaves and stuff in it. Boy, they're hungry down there, folks. They are hungry. Oh, did I? No, I didn't lose him. He just started following me up. Another, another red snapper. Uh, yeah, so far it's been one vermilion. This is my third red snapper. There's a bunch of red snapper down there. I may put a sabiki on to try to get some of, some of those vermilions. Yeah, yeah. Ruby. Got a ruby? All right, Big John got himself. Let me see that black sea bass. A 13-incher. 
That's a key. Oh, that's a nice one. Yep, there's a nice black sea bass Big John just got. So he got the skunk out of the boat on the front. The skunk is out of the boat. I got me a little black sea bass and a grunt that I'm going to keep. Let the black sea bass go. Keep the grunt. We are on the fish. Man, we are in the fish. That's for sure. The Lord's going to bless us richly today. Rare Jabez. All right. Sabiki down again. I need to stock up on bait. Sometimes you can catch a nice vermilion, even a trigger fish. Ah, another little black sea bass and another little grunt that I'll keep for bait. Let me let this black sea bass go. Let's hope hey, we can. Man. Yeah. Take, take a look at what that black sea bass spit up. That's going to be my next bait. Yeah. Oh. That's a little squid or something. No, that's some sort of a rock rock uh, creature. It hangs on to rocks, I think. I think. They're down there eating everything, aren't they? Fish here. I may have a black sea bass or something worth putting in the cooler. Yeah, on the sabiki. Or I got a bunch of other somethings. Oh, got a trigger. Got a little trigger. Nah, they gotta be they gotta be 14. I'll measure him, but he's he's too short. There is four or five species. And he is oh man. To the fork he's 12 and a half. 12 and a half. Yeah, a couple of years ago. 12 was 12 was in a couple of years ago. Not now. <laughs> you know, that's how we like to catch these fish around here, folks. Four at a time. With all those vermilions, they're just too small. They have to be 12 inches with a tail pinched. And I can tell this one's 11. <laughs> this one's 10. But I'm keeping them two rubies right there. I'm keeping them two ruby lips because I'm going to put one down for bait. Right now, that one right there, we'll put down for bait for big fish. And Big John pulls up eh? another black sea bass. That's close. I was going to say he's 12 and a half. Huh? He's close. He got one big enough. All right. Let's see what we got here. This does not feel like a red snapper. This feels like a black sea bass, but you never know here. A uh, little red snapper. Hang on. I'm looking for Mr. Black Sea Bass. Pretty good size red snapper, come to think of it. Not so little. He took off my piece of tail. It feels like a black sea bass, but it's nothing but a red snapper. Let's see what Mr. Big John got. We're catching all kinds of little vermilions and little. Yeah, yeah. One vermilion and two grunts. A lane. A little, oh, big enough lane, big enough lane, snapper. Big enough. Yep, that's about a 12 inch lane. That's plenty big enough. That old Big John again. Man, he is showing me up. I'm getting bites on my line over here, but it's not anything serious. John's got oh, vermilion, vermilion. Oh, and a trigger. You got three species on that line right there, John. That's <laughs> right. Unfortunately, none of That feel like Mr. Red Snapper. That doesn't feel like Mr. Black Sea Bass. Uh, this is on the middle half of a grunt. Yeah, I'm pretty sure did miss a red snapper. And I'm pretty sure I'm not right. Blue runner. Blue runner bait. Cut bait. Cut bait. Blue, 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 blue runner. Yep. 
There you go. Blue runner. Big one. Your brother David over there, he's wrestling. He thinks another red snapper. Another one? I think it's uh, Lane? Lane snapper. Whoa, all right. Lift it up and let me see. He looks like a keeper. What do they got to be? Uh, eight eight inches. inches, that's all. Ooh, he's a good one. Has he got a big spot on the back? That's a vermilion. I, oh, no. He's got the yellow. Yeah, that's a lane. Oh yeah, nice one. Wow, big one. Woo! Ah. Sailfish, sailfish. I saw a bird. Look at him go. He's still going. Sailfish. I don't know. He's having fun, I guess. Why is he doing it? He's having fun. Wow. Big John got something worthwhile. This is your biggest one today, I think, so far. Is that on your sabiki type rig? Yes, that's on my four hooker. Your four hooker? Oh, I see it down there. One fish. You're looking a little reddish. Nope. It is a... What, is that a blue runner? No. That looks... That looks... That looks a little odd. <laughs> is that a blue runner? That looks like a jack of some sort. Mm. This is on a big old shrimp. This is on Mr. Big Shrimp. Uh. Yeah, it's a jack of some sort. We have an opportunity to catch some tunas out here. What have I got here? Huh? It's got the long fin. Yeah. That's a jack of some sort. It might be a blue runner, but. You got it ready? Yeah, it's a red snapper. It's supposed to be something other than a red snapper because they're supposed to be very endangered. But they're not. You tell me that's something I can take home. Um. Snaggy. Even if I uh, had an ID on them, I couldn't tell you because they don't show exactly. You can take them home. Why can't you take them home? Take them home. Just another Mr. Snapper. We'll see. I see him down there. Or another one of these blue runner type things. It is some sort of a jack. I don't think it's a, uh, I really don't think it's a tuna, because I don't see any markings on it. With those long fins, like the... Yeah. Boy, I hate not knowing something, you know. I'm going to let him go. I don't need him. All right, you experts at home, tell me what that is. That looks just like a gigantic blue runner to me. Well, I just caught this lean snapper. I'm gonna give to Big John. He swallowed the. He swallowed the hook. Get open, dangle. Open, dangle. So I just let it sit down there on the bottom for a little while. All right. Oh, he broke off. Dang, on it. All right, we are on our way out to a little bit of a deep, deeper reef, and there's a natural area right here. So we've stopped, and I already caught a legal size black sea bass on the sabiki over this natural area. So we're going to stop and stay here for a little while. I think I saw 
That could be Brother David over there. And here, Brother John. He's pulling up a. 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 Big. Medium. Size. Oh, black sea bass. Could be. Oh, man. Look at there. Could be. Could be something nice. I'm getting a bite here, too. Mm. Oh, man. I don't think that's a black sea bass. <laughs> Goobly goo. Oh, I see Mr. Turtle over there. Hello, Mr. Turtle. Is that Myrtle? Hey, Myrtle. That's Myrtle the turtle. Myrtle the sea turtle. Oh, goodness. And I got a floater out back there for the sardine on it. We are in 81.1 feet of water on a gorgeous, beautiful January day. Uh, feel like nothing but a big old, big old red snapper. I'll give this black sea bass. It's a world record. And it's not a black sea bass. But that's what I want. I'm catching these pesty. Twelve and a half, Lane. Oh, man. I hate it for you. Twelve and a half. This is over natural area, folks. And this is a big, great big, biggest one yet. Big red snapper. Circle hook decided to lip. Red snapper. That's about a 25er. That's about a two footer. Don't you splash me. I might just keep you, you splash me. No, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> that big John, he's hooked into something that's got a bone or two. Black sea bass. And I swear that's a keeper. That's a keeper. That's a 14er. That's a 14er there. Wow. Good one, John. Let me know. 14. I told you. John just measured him up. He's 14 inches. This one here is about 12. One I got about 12. John's showing me up again. Man. So I'll measure this one up because he is close. He's close. Oh, he's real close. I don't even think he's closer than close. <sighs> oh man. Yeah, he's not not my bait in there. He is, this guy is easily 14 and a half. Woo! Woo! Thank you, Lord, for nice big fatty blah, blah, black sea bass. You want your uh you want this up there? Put it in. There you go. That's oh. Miss, that is Mr. Snapper or something. That's a big fish, John. <laughs> it almost pulled John in the water. It almost pulled Big John in the water. I'll bet you that's a big old red snapper. We'll get back to you in just a little bit when we see. Woo. That's a big old red snapper there, Big John. I'm big sure it's big enough for me. <sighs> and I got one coming up too. They're everywhere, they're everywhere. Alrighty. Let me get him off. And get this line back out there. You can't drop anything down here without getting hit with something. I dropped the old sabiki down just for a second just to see. I don't even think I have any bait on there. It just flies. A little black sea bass. Little guy. Little one? Yeah, little, little guy. Small fry little guy. Mr. BSB might be big enough for me. Mr. BSB, big enough for me. 
Let's check it out and see if he's big enough for me. He is 13 and a half. Another one in the Kula. Thank you, Lord. This is a little bit of a mystery. He didn't feel like a snapper, and he felt too big to be a black sea bass. But we'll see. I'm thinking snapper. I think it's Mr. Red Snapper. That That's was what right. Looks like to me. Yep, Red Snapper. Not that I'm getting tired of catching fish, because I'm not. It sure is fun. Natural bottom. I'm getting ready to drop these cams down because I am real interested in what's on the bottom here. Current's not too bad, the waves aren't too big. And I'm interested to see just how many of these black sea bass. What is that? Oh, that's just a red snapper. Yeah, it's just a little red snapper, not a big one, just a little one. But I'm gonna drop these cams down. We'll see what's down there. See if there's any black sea bass that are big. Because we know there's big red snapper down there. Okay.
This is a rich Napa doobie doobie doo. I just caught a 13 and a half inch or so black sea bass. Now, I got this here rich Napper. I hope he hasn't wrapped around my down cams. Yep, rich Napper. How does it they swall it keep swallowing the hook? It's a big old circle hook. Ow. It's a big red snapper, that's for sure. It's about 22 inches long. I see the hook right there. Big old circle hook. Yep. There it is. Get a big old shrimp on here. Yeah, 
Yeah, I'm getting some good little bites. Whoa, big shark, big shark. Big shark heading out there to my sardine. Pick it up, we're gonna have to go in now. I just stowed the trolling motor. And old Big John, he catches a uh, trigger fish. He's a little short, gotta be 14. Okay, cool. Let's go home. <laughs>